Oh, you read that correctly, folks. The subreddit Feminism has blocked me. Welcome back, everyone. I'm Gator the Legend, and I'm a little fucking pissed off. See, around this time last year, I made a video called Women's March Was a Lie, hashtag fake news. In this video, I point out the fact that the Women's March was actually not a Women's March at all. See, my number one issue with this so-called Women's March is that there were just as many men there as there were women. Typical man trying to take half the credit for a woman's accomplishment. And even before pointing out the lie that had just been told to us and sold to us, I expressed my admiration for the cause and what it's supposed to stand for. Women of all ages, religion, f races, joining together to march for a cause. Beautiful. And of course, the old gator was very supportive at first. I, I mean, seriously, how cool is it that all of these women decided to march together and to make a difference in this world? But herein lies the issue. As far as I could tell, I was the only one who was noticing this injustice. That's why I made the video. Then a year passes, I don't think too much about it until I read the headlines. It was happening again. The Women's March was back, and this time bigger than ever. So with a heart filled with hope, I start to look at some of the pictures from this festive event, hoping, praying, that I don't see any men. I couldn't believe it. After all I did to stop this, it was like no one was listening. It was like, it was like no one cared. I thought, I'll make another video. That should help. But I knew it wouldn't be enough. I barely even made a dent with the last video. So I thought, I thought to myself for a minute, I was like, how can, how can I really make a difference? You know? Because uh, the facts are, no one wants to listen to another white male telling them what he knows. I thought, what if it came from those who stand to lose the most? What if it came from women? Now that I had a plan to take down all these men who were trying to destroy another great movement for women all over the world, I needed a place where I could reach out to the women of the world and let them know what I knew. This ended up being the biggest mistake of my entire life. So I found a subreddit called Feminism. They had over 85,000 subscribers. And I was thinking, they just may have an audience big enough to spread my message. So I posted the message with a link. Proof Women's March is a lie. I was like, finally, I'm going to be heard. Women were going to see my story and see the injustice that was going on and make a difference. I couldn't have been more wrong. Within seconds, I received this message. You've been banned from participating in feminism. I could still view and subscribe, but I would no longer be allowed to post or comment. I was shocked. I didn't understand what I did wrong. I didn't understand why I'd been blocked. I was just trying to help, trying to bring awareness. I just personally needed to know what I did. So I asked. What rule did I break? Over 20 minutes passed and nothing. See, I remembered a piece of information that is vital to the situation. Before posting anything, I made sure to read every last rule for their subreddit. So as I sat there, I thought back over all the rules and I realized something. I didn't break any of the rules. I was more confused than ever. I had to know why I had been banned from feminism. So I wrote them again. I read all the rules. I don't see which one I broke. Please let me know. This time, I had a response within minutes. All posts and discussions must be relevant to women's issues. I looked through your video. It's not relevant. And this isn't a place to self-promote entertainment. I was absolutely shocked at this response. How was my video not relevant to women's issues? As far as I could tell, this was one of the biggest issues they were facing. I mean, men are literally trying to hijack your event. How could you stand for this? And to their point of it not being a self-promote entertainment, let's not forget, I read all the rules, and nowhere did it state that you were not allowed, as they put it, self-promote entertainment. I immediately respond, how is it not relevant? It's literally about the Women's March. It's been advertised as one thing, and it's not. I made a video to make people aware of this. You were filtering me out simply because you don't like that I'm right. This is a direct attack of my freedom of speech. Furthermore, nowhere in the rules does it state that we are not allowed to self-promote or entertain. I was so upset. I, I wasn't even thinking anymore, just typing. I couldn't believe that my, my good intentions have been taken so incorrectly. My heart was breaking. You know, at this point, I was just starting to think about the whole situation. Uh, you know, I reminded myself of what led us to this moment. You know, I remember what my goal was, to help women, to help people right in injustice. So I was ready to apologize 
when I receive this response. LOL, this is a sub. Your freedom of speech is non-existent here. I'm not the government censoring you. I'm someone removing you from a section of private website. Tough luck. And if that's confusing, off to remedial American politics with you. Furthermore, it's up to the mod's discretion what is and is not relevant. And crappy attempts at entertainment that kind of vaguely ramble about the women's march with no clear point and an accent that fades in and out? No. I was embarrassed. Ashamed. I, I, I couldn't believe this was happening to me. I didn't want to hurt anyone. I didn't mean to upset anyone. I was only ever trying to help. And all I tried to do was just help. <laughs> but they were right. If they wanted to ban me, they had every right to. I was foolish to think that the little old gator could actually make a difference. So I decided I'd give in. I'd play their game. I would apologize, promise to play by the new rule, and maybe even ask for a second chance. But when I went to send the message, I got this error. It wouldn't let me send my message. When I went back to the message thread, I saw one last message from feminism. No further attempts at contact are welcome. You will be reported to the admin should you persist. Now, shh. It was over. I lost. My mission to save the Women's March was a failure. But it wasn't just myself I was letting down. It was half the population. Feminism, I don't know if you'll see this, but I, I just want to say I'm so, so sorry. I'm so sorry. This is all just, it's just a big misunderstanding. I would never do anything to hurt you. I hope someday you can forgive me. And hopefully, you know, if enough time passes, maybe you could even unban me. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I've been the Gator, and you've been great. Peace. I eat shit on my tacos in front of small children. I make a mess and then I throw an unusual tantrum. Why can't I only fit two dicks in my ass? Am I a meme yet? Am I a meme yet?